On Wednesday, October 25, 2023 at 4 p.m. KST, the last episodes of the popular drama The Worst of Evil were shown on Disney+. These episodes numbered 10, 11, and 12 respectively. In the final three episodes, the show aimed to pack in as much action and drama as possible, which led to an explosive and emotionally draining conclusion. It tells the narrative of a police investigator named Park Jun Mo, played by Jai chang -wook who infiltrates a drug syndicate while working undercover. He has the intention of taking out the mafia leader Yung Gi Chiao, who is played by Wai Ha Jun, but he is oblivious of the possible outcomes. The conclusion of The Worst of Evil, Episode 12, reveals that Jun Mo was ultimately successful in the inquiry. However, there is a significant cost associated with it. In addition to taking the life of the mafia leader Yung Gi Chiao, he also ends his relationship with his wife, Yu Yi Young. The Korean drama came to a tragic and bittersweet conclusion as Jun Mo lost everything. The conclusion of The Worst of Evil Episode 12 centers on Jai Chang-wook and Wai Ha Jun's confrontation for the last time. At the beginning of Episode 12, Seo Jong Ryle is shown fatally shooting Seok Du Hyung. In the meantime, police officer A Chuang Mingu has arrested Yung Gi Chiaol as a result of the information provided by Choi Young Bi and Hong Hee Sung. Park Jun Mo arrives at the site while they are still on their way, causes an accident with the officer's car, and then saves Gi Chul. Jun Mo, on the other hand, is completely unaware of the fact that Du Hyung has passed away. In addition to this, the prosecutor Cho deceives him by telling him that Du Hyung has lived while in reality he has not. It is only because they are so close to finding the truth that he urges Jun Mo to see the probe through to its conclusion. After some time has passed, Gi Chiaol and Jun Mo engage in a profound discussion regarding their respective lives. However, this is the very last chat of a regular kind that the two have before things take an awful turn shortly after this one. While H. Wang Min Good is still in the hospital getting well, he issues a warrant for the arrest of a guy named Seung Ho. During this time, Lee Hee Ryon is putting the pharmaceuticals that she has been given by Choi Young Bi and Hong Hee Sung through their paces. She entrusts Jun Mo with the delivery address to Japan by providing them with the information. Her confidence was betrayed almost immediately when H. Wang Min Gu revealed Jun Mo's true identity to her after discovering it himself. It comes as a complete surprise to her that Jun Mo is a married man and a law enforcement officer. When she confronts the latter, the latter's silence provides all the answers that she needs. She then proceeds to end the life of the police officer by stabbing him. The ending of The Worst of Evil has a note that is both bitter and sweet. After revealing his true identity, Jun Mo handcuffs Gi Chiaol and then receives the narcotics in exchange. Gi Chiaol is standing there in disbelief after hearing the news. Gi Chiaol manages to get away, however, when Jun Mo intentionally abandons both the key to the automobile and the key to the shackles. The members of the drug cartel are apprehended as a result of Jun Mo's confrontation with them. Jun Mo and his wife Yui Jong find out about Du Haiyang's passing, and they go to pay their respects at his tomb. When they get back to their house, they discover Gi Chul staring at a photo of them while clutching a pistol and getting ready to fire. Additionally, Jun Mo pulls out his own firearm. Gi Chul is taken aback by the treachery, and he inquires of them as to whether or not they are ever sincere to him. Jun Mo opens fire on Gi Chul, putting an end to his life before he has a chance to shoot himself in the head. A promotion has been given to both Jun Mo and Yu Yeung. Despite this, they leave apart, which is a clear sign that their relationship has come to an end. Jun Mo pays a visit to Gi Chul's grave, lights a cigarette, and then lays it, along with his wedding ring, in the grave. Despite the fact that Jun Mo put his life in danger and was successful in the inquiry, he was not able to save his wife or Gi Chiaol. Thanks for watching, and if you're new to channel subscribe and click the bell, so you don't miss out latest videos of Media Breakdown.